What does it mean to be a part of Intermountain Healthcare? It means that the quest for excellence is not just a goal, but a given. It means providing a service experience that fully honors the art of healing. It means building an environment where physicians and employees can deliver the best in medicine. And it's realizing each employee and volunteer is vital to the healing process because we can only achieve the extraordinary together. Working for Intermountain includes options for benefit participation, including health and dental benefits, continuing education through our education assistance program, and a pension and 401k plan to help prepare for the future. Want to get started? Here's an overview of surgical oriented positions offered by Intermountain. My name is Tyler. I am a CP tech at Intermountain Healthcare. When I first started in central processing, I was 18 years old, right out of high school. Um, I was just looking for any job I could get. I interviewed for the position. Uh, they told me all that I would be required to memorize and learn. And as I came into the position and saw all that there was to learn, I was overwhelmed by what was in front of me. But uh, I always had a trainer with me and uh, we walked through things. Uh, this position definitely requires a little bit stronger of a stomach because you receive instrumentation right after surgery is completed. We have different circumstances, different patients require different things. And so each day there's a, there are new challenges to overcome and it, it keeps things interesting and challenging. And as you finish your training, you then take a home study course of a national certification exam that uh, you're required to take. And uh, as you finish the exam, uh, you move into a, a central processing tech level two and from there you are able to progress and move into specialist and, and supervisory coordinator positions. This is a great entry level position with the opportunity to advance. The central processing tech learns hundreds of surgical instruments that are used daily. They clean and sterilize these instruments and prepare them for the surgical teams. The quality of their work has a direct impact on the quality of patient care. This job can be physically demanding. Central processing techs must have the ability to lift 50 pounds regularly and remain on their feet for long periods of time, often through their entire shift. A sharp memory and attention to detail are essential qualities of a central processing tech. They also must have great communication skills, both orally and on paper. They have the ability to accurately follow instructions and procedures. If you have these skills and are interested in an exciting career, we want to hear from you. Advice or encouragement that I would give to somebody that was looking at this position uh, would be, it's not as bad as it looks. You work with a good team of individuals that are there to answer questions. Uh, you're not left alone, but at the same time you can feel like you've accomplished something. I'm Cheryl. I'm an OR tech at Intermountain Healthcare. When I first started working as an OR tech here at Intermountain Healthcare, I had um, two years of training prior to coming here uh, due to the schooling that I had. We had to watch surgeries uh, via the web and we would always bring a pizza in while we watched the surgery and one of our ongoing jokes is if you can't eat pizza while you watch surgery, you're not cut out for surgery. I felt a little nervous getting in and being on my own because when you do your training you have someone right there with me but Inner Mountain Healthcare provided someone to um, be right there with me to answer all of my questions and to jump in if there was something I was hesitating on so I was not left alone to figure this out. Now that I've been here at, at Intermountain Healthcare as, a, as an OR tech for four years, I feel completely competent and capable to scrub any type of surgery, even a surgery that I haven't previously done. The surgical technologist provides the surgical team with clinical expertise in the handling of instruments, supplies, and equipment during surgery. Not only will you assist with the nursing care of patients in the operating room under registered nurse supervision, but you will also perform routine delegated duties according to the standards of practice and department policies. You are an essential team member who is capable of anticipating needs and readily supplying the surgeon with required tools. To become a surgical technologist, you must complete an accredited surgical technology program and have a healthcare provider or professional rescue or CPR certification. I think the encouragement that I would give to anyone wanting to get into the medical field is 
get out there and get in. If there's an entry level position that doesn't require a degree, get in and get going and, and start laying the brickwork. I find a lot of satisfaction in um, helping the physician and getting their thanks on, on having a good day. I like that they feel that their patients have received good care. I really enjoy knowing that I am helping people even though they are not sure that I am even there, but I'm able to help them to leave the hospital healthier than they came in. I'm able to see a wide range of surgeries, a wide range of medical conditions. I've seen the joys of babies being born, um, and I've seen some of the tragedies. You get to work um, on things that most people don't even understand or know anything about. I feel like an integral part of a team where I can help people heal. I make sure that we have the right uh, dressings and sutures and um, instrumentation that we'll need to correct whatever problem the person is there for.